everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome for the first time my name is Deasia, but you can call me D and this is my Slaytober Halloween series where I'm doing 31 days of Halloween looks every day of October and if you want to see how I achieve those looks check out my recent videos subscribe like and comment and if you want to see how I achieve this beautiful makeup look continue on watching this video okay I'm going to start out by brushing my eyebrows up and then I'm going in with my P. Louise base and shade white to fill in my eyebrows. In my Lisa Frank palette, I picked up this um, lavender shade and that's what I'm going to use to put on my eyebrows. I'm actually going to do an ombre eyebrow with this look and go in with some blue from that same palette. To clean up under my eyebrows, I'm using my MAC concealer in shade NW40. Next, I'm going in with my loose highlighter from Beast by Dad's Cosmetics. I'm just going to add that in on my eyebrows to give it some more shimmer. With my Pillowy's base in shade 0, I'm going to prime my eyelids. Remember my previous look when I forgot to um, record me doing my eyeshadow? So I really didn't forget. I found out that I, the video is stuck on my camera. I don't know what it is about me doing my eyeshadow and my camera wanting to keep it to itself, but that's super, super whack. And that's just whack. Like, I'm so mad y'all can't see how I did this look because it's stuck on the camera. Like, do you want me to be great or not? I'm gonna finish the rest of my face so we can skip to the mermaid part and all of the, um, products are going to be in the description. When you look at the description, go leave a comment, period. Once again, I'm missing a clip. Like, it's so annoying to me because I don't sit in front of this camera for hours just to not be able to use all my clips. Like, it's super annoying. But I just went in with the same um, colors I went in on my eyeshadow. You wouldn't know which colors I went in because I don't got that clip either. <sighs> I went in with my Lisa Frank palette and the blue, the purple, and this shimmery silver. And that's what I did to create this look. I basically did the same as if I was contouring with colors. To clean up my mermaid lines and to make it appear more like scales, um, I'm going in with my foundation. And a trick to when you are um, coloring on top of the net, try to keep the net as still as possible so um, it won't be a lot of cleaning up that you have to do afterwards. I'm using some um, glitter. It don't have a name on it, but it's by Flutter by Row, and that's what I'm using to go in on all my spaces. I don't know. I just wanted it to be more shimmery, more glittery, more girly, whatever word you want to use. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted, and that's what I felt like I was giving. I am using lash glue um, for this part and what I did is just I went in to a little bit of squares at a time so um, by the time I get to the other side the lash glue won't be dry and then I just started doing that um, as I finished. So I'm about to go in with this purple lipstick. I had this for a long time. I don't even know what is. I don't know who's it by. Oh, Hard Candy. I probably got it from Walmart. While that dries down for a bit, I'm going to go ahead and do in my eyes. In my waterline, I'm using my P. Louise base. 
with the same colors that I've been using, I'm gonna go in with that purple and put that on my waterline. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go in with, now I do wanna keep the whole purple and blue thing going on, so I'm gonna go with, um, let's go with blue. Period. I'm going in with that dark purple right up under that. Yeah, right up under that. I'm gonna go in with that light pink again that I went up under my um in my transition yeah that is cute yo that's cute <laughs> okay so I thought my lipstick was gonna dry down by itself so it didn't so I had to go in with that same shade of purple and just mount it down using that um same cap or whatever going to do like an ombre just with the silver and the pink but well, I don't really know what colors I'm gonna use I'm just about to go ahead and glue it the first color that I used is these is this light um like this shimmery silver color oh that is bomb Oh, that's bomb. Mm hmm So I don't want to add no bottom lashes, so I'm gonna show y'all a trick that I like to do um, to make it look like I got bone bottom lashes or got bottom lashes, period, because I don't. You can use any black eyeliner, black lipstick, anything black. I'm using lipstick because it's easier to wash off. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna make dots. going in with our mascara and today I'm using the wet and wild mega wear and just do a do so I'm going back to my set mm. I don't know what I was trying to say Using my Blue Pluie's base and Touch of Frost, I'm cleaning up whichever black dot I put on my waterline by accident. This is almost done. I really am loving it, but I do want to add some more highlight. So going in with my Beats by Debs Cosmetics High Loose Highlighter. I'm just pet this all over. Take down my hair. I'm gonna put a few clips in. This is the final look, y'all. Already know what I'm about to say. Y'all already know what I'm about to say. I am in love with this look. I feel like it came out bomb. Per usual, as always, every day, every time I post, all my looks are gonna be bomb. And this is just one of those cases. This is one of those cases where we ended up with another bomb look, period. 
So I got done with this look at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. I don't know about y'all, but I just feel like that's dedication and I'm about to do another one. Mm. I'm cooking good stuff up. I'm cooking real good stuff up. I'm going to add some type of um, um, accessory in my hair. So I was thinking about going in with this flower. Yeah, I'm going to go in with this flower. Hair pins to put it on. Okay, there we go. Don't do that. Don't do that. Thanks so much for watching this video. I really enjoyed this makeup look. It was super fun, super tedious, but fun and super cute. Versatile, you can choose any colors that you want, any three colors. Just make sure that you have some shimmer in there. And yeah, so thanks so much for tuning in to this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Share it with your friends and don't forget to turn your post notifications on so you will be notified the next time I upload a video for my series. Thanks again for watching and see you guys next time.